Ezra Anderson here. We are taking a look at my current implementation of the Bullet Physics Library into the MOI SDK. This is my current end result. It's a proof of concept that the two open source libraries work quite well with each other. I'm going to just play for a second and then I'll try to tell you what exactly you are looking at. Okay, you are looking at a ragdoll dummy held together with different types of joints attached to a board by a joint zooming down a mountain trying to avoid these Minecraft looking trees. If you hit a tree your dummy falls apart or goes flinging off into space. Um, I'm just gonna show you a couple more things here. The first thing I did was try to get debug drawing working. So if you're trying to get bullet physics library working inside another framework, uh, I recommend getting the debug drawing working first. Because once you have that working, you can then start going through the demos of the bullet physics library and implementing parts of that into the framework. And that's what I did. I got the debug drawing working and then I just grabbed a demo and I just plugged it into C. Once the demo was working, I started making the Lua bindings to make that demo from Lua. This did work quite well until I got to about the fifth or sixth demo and then I realized, wow, I made a bunch of mistakes because I was new to the bullet physics library. I didn't actually know how to use the library itself. So I was using the demos and the manual and the Wikipedia to try to get a better understanding of the bullet physics library and I just kind of cobblestoned it in one demo at a time. Then I got to about demo five or six and I went, oh my, my complete structure is wrong. I need to kind of redo it all. So what you're looking at now is kind of just before I'm going to do a major refactoring of code to make the bullet physics library work better with inside the MOI SDK itself. Um, you know, that's just programming. You start doing it, you do it, you do it, you do it, you do it, you get to a point and you go, oops, I made a mistake, and then you redo it all. So, yeah, here we go. It's pretty exciting, I think, that you can now kind of use this library to make really basic games, because I only got the basic part of the bullet physics library merged into the MOI SDK. Also, the MOI SDK now has a plugin system, so I can write this entire thing as a plugin, and you can just build your MOI host by adding this plugin, and then you have the functionality of this plugin, which is very nice because before you had to plug everything into the actual framework. Now you can kind of sandbox a concept or demo into a plugin, get other people to test it as a plugin. You don't need to add it right into the core of MOI SDK. Anyways, that's it. Take a look at the demo. I think I have the binaries for OS X, Linux, Windows on the form. You can try the short little game demo. Kind of give me your feedback. Um, hopefully I'm going to add more Bullet API and fix a bunch of things this week. Okay, great. Thanks.